What kind of uh, materials can you use on it? Tons of materials. So yeah, software and hardware freedom, but also material freedom. Um, you can print with the standard ABS and PLA and HIPS, um, but you can also print with industrial nylons, uh, tea glass, which is a heavy duty plastic. And yeah, we've got some of these here. Yeah, so this is a tea glass print that, uh, that came off the Lulzbot Mini. And we've also got a nylon print, and this actually holds water. Uh, this also came off the of Lulzbot Mini. And, and then we've got some really fine resolution parts here. Um, and then, of course, a shout out, the, this is the Roctopus. So this is the really the spirit animal of the mini. Uh, it's a derivative of uh, Ye Old Brian's octopus on uh, Thingiverse, uh, and then we added, of course, some rocking to it. So Kent Johnson was the designer that made this, and we're really excited about it. It's pretty great. Yeah. What's the resolution detail on the prints? It looks pretty good. Uh, it is really fine resolution. We haven't done any formal benchmarking, uh, but we're finding it's performing um, on par with the Taz. So, you know, around 7,500 micron, depending on the material, print speed, things like that. So we'll have formal specs out when the machine gets released. Cool. Uh, when do you have a release date? Specifically? It is. We're going for December and uh, keeping an eye on uh, December 1st. So. Price? Uh, 1350. 1350. And yeah. it's completely assembled, everything? Fully assembled, one year warranty, one year customer support, uh, and of course, the Lulzbot community. So kind of join the party as soon as that arrives on your doorstop. What kind of setup do you have to do when you get it? Uh, right out of the box. Take it out of the box and plug it in. Yeah, we. Uh, it's going to be really, really easy to get running. We're excited about it. Cool. And uh, I guess you guys work with Fargo 3D printing. You got some new, uh, they have some new filaments. You we know? do, yeah. So we're here with one of our reseller partners, uh, which is Fargo 3D printing. And yeah, they just did a really exciting announcement at the show, uh, really pushing the envelope in terms of environmentally friendly filament. Um, so not only is the PLA, it has a special NGO certification, but the spool that it comes on is also an environmentally friendly uh, fiber uh, that can break down over time. But, uh, we think it's a really exciting advancement, so you should definitely uh, keep an eye on them and what they're working on. Absolutely. Cool. Yeah. Well, thanks so much, Harris. I appreciate your time. Sure. Uh, I hope you had a good show, and we'll see you soon. Thanks so much. All right, appreciate thanks. it.